Hello everybody, my name is Dion Robinson and I am back with you with another exciting information about the Dark East Show Show book series. And this is my fourth blog and I do appreciate everybody for joining me in. Uh, I am very excited to present this, um, this, this book series I've been writing since last year. And today I want to discuss something about the book series which I've been working on to make very unique for, um, for people to enjoy. Uh, so last time uh, in my videos, I introduced you to the um, the map, you know, the terrorist name map, and pretty much, you know, that that vlog there, or you know, passing out the information there, you know, sharing it, sharing it with you people out there, um, it's pretty much um, has been very has been very you know exciting to do so, because um, pretty much like you know, I like to share things with people, uh, especially with my creative with my creative work and stuff like that. So, my thing right now is like, you know, I do have another exciting piece to the content that I'm creating with the book series, and that is also known as the, um, you know, what, is, well, excuse me, uh, pretty much what I'm, what I'm about to introduce to you is like, you know, it's something that's very personal to me. I have been, I have been diligently working on trying to, you know, bring this content out as far as like, you know, the, as the another aspect to the book series, and that uh content is is the the language system of, of the book series itself so pretty much um for the past you know six months you no know, uh i think starting last year october that i have been thinking about trying to create a a, a language structure for the series you know and the reason for that is because like you know since I'm creating another world or another realm in which is a high fantasy you know the book series is high fantasy and the story is taking place in another realm of course you know people are going to have their own language you know own writing system and so forth so pretty much um that's what i've been, been working on you know pretty much i've been doing a lot of things you know trying to you know make sure i can get it right for you know for the audience uh make sure it's believable and also make sure it is is unique you know what i mean by unique is um i'm pretty much designing it from scratch and so so here we go so pretty much the language system is called Vijakai, you know, uh, pretty much, um, you know, it, you know, pretty much uh, I've been doing a lot of research and trying to, you know, figure out how I want the, the script, the script to go or the, the, the fonts of the, of the, um, of the language to go. And pretty much uh, I have been doing a lot of research, you know, with the, uh, with a lot of Eastern uh, writing, such as uh, Japanese, Chinese, uh, Tamil, Korean. However, um, all those all those were, were great, you know, which I have incorporated into the writing system. But uh, but the one main writing system I, I have really been focusing on was the Mongolian writing system. All Cal, uh, excuse me, the Mongolian writing system, which is known as uh, I think it's Calcutan, I think. Um, I, I you know I put it in below the, uh, the comments, you know, when I get a chance to you know. But anyway, so pretty much I've been I I really have been looking at the. Um, like the breast script and also the uh, how the language is spoken and my main inspiration comes from the, sh the sounds of the chakra systems and stuff like that it has like a vibration within the vocals um how the way we speak so pretty much um my progress to the story right now is basically um i have designed the font i kind of sketch it out on paper and just come up with my own design so that's just pretty much it what i'm doing right now so yeah I do thank you for joining me in, and um, I hope you uh, enjoyed the video. I do apologize for the mistakes I have done. So, again, thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed the video. Take care and peace.